Okay. Yeah. I invoked some stores in the use of connect. Uh, There it is, as cruel and unforgiving as I remember. You were once imprisoned here. Oh no, I have never been inside. In fact, I have never stood closer than this very place. It was from here that I would fly my kite high over these prison walls. It had a unique pattern, you see. One I stitched together with my father when I was just a boy. So here I came, day after day, hoping for a gust that would take it high enough so that he would see it and know that I was here. I do not know if he ever did. I know this pain, and I am sorry for yours. I am not. Such pains forge our paths, remind us of who we are, who we can be. Speaking of paths, I see only one, and it is not inviting. No. We need to find a way to get you inside without being seen. Could this help? Where did you get that? Beshi. He told me these tokens command a high value among the common folk. Indeed. You could perhaps bribe the guards to look the other way, or enlist the help of some merchants. I shall see what flavor best suits me. I will take my leave and return to the Bureau. Fuck Allah. What do you see, Enkidu? You are shrewd men of business. Care to hear a proposition? <sighs> so long as it is an attractive one, my friend. What is it? I need to get into the prison. Unnoticed. I thought perhaps you could let me pose as one of your aides. Hmm. Possibly. And in exchange? Let me think on it. What? Are you men with Ali? <laughs> we were. But it has been weeks since we have seen him, and the rebels have all but disbanded. That is only temporary. Ali is being held in this prison. Ali? Here? I feared him dead. I will free him. 
but I need your help to get me inside. And who are you? We want nothing more than to see our leader return, but how do I know you can be trusted? Beshi told me I could exchange this token for your help. What say you? If he gave you this, he must hold you in high regard. We will take care of the guards. Watch us closely, then make your move. Okay, that went sound real bad. Act as usual. Okay, blend him with the cows. Start from last save, please. What time is it now? This one. Yeah. Thank <laughs> you. 
Ali has been taken somewhere beneath the prison and likely tortured. I need to hurry. Hold on. I'll feed you your spleen. Okay, damn it. did this to you? The... Jailer. Where is he? With another... Beneath us. Death will come for him soon. He may be speaking of Ali. I pray I am not too late. I never thought demons could walk the earth. But that man is evil. Do not lose him. That is what the Jailer wants. He wants to break us. Oh, he already has.
Okay, I need to find a key. Oh damn blood And you are? Basim, friend to Noor. Let us save the details for another time. We need to get you out of here. Slow yourself, Ya Azizi. We cannot leave, not yet. I need to get into the guards' quarters. What for? It is Al Ghul you are after, is it not? The guards of this prison serve him. They take shifts escorting groups of prisoners to dig sites under the cover of night. If we can find their orders, we may know where Al Ghul is going next. Is that reason enough? Stay close to me, stay low, and do not. St oh, come, Basim. I know how to defend myself. Really? What with? Let's try not to get in each other's way. Tell me, Basim, because I must know. Just how did you make it down here? Easy. I sucked in my belly and wiggled through the cracks. Take it as a compliment. I know your kind like to frolic in the dark, but within the world's greatest feet. Ali, one day I will tell you all about my past. Then you will understand. Such a tease. much time. Break it down! Oh. Ali! I heard you! Over there! By the armor! No. Hurry! I have it! Take it to Roshan, my master. She is with your rebels at the water mill stronghold. I will slow the guards. Now go! No. Yeah! 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 Yeah!
Oh shit. No, 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 no. Change that. I should not regroup with Ali. The risk is too great. Things that pass for art these days. I have delayed long enough. I should find Ali and see what we can learn about Al Ghul. Not here, are you? I'll teach you my shoulder fan. They always fall for it. Yeah. 
Okay. Vamos ver. This looks like the place. Now where is Ali? It is due, for this man came to my aid at my darkest hour. And from what I have heard, I am not the only one. <clears throat> I will pay a great tribute to you in a chronicle of our exploits. But we must first write the end of it. Come. I see you two have met. Only briefly. But the night is young and there is much to discuss. About what you can procure for me. Our means are limited. But rest assured, I will listen to your needs, Ali. Later. Share what you know about al Ghul, so that Basim may do what he's come here to do. Yes, yes, yes. Your affairs before mine. But just this once. Al Ghul sends orders to the prison guards detailing where to dig around Baghdad. But it's not just prisoners he's using. There is a promissory note for workers here. It looks like Al Ghul arranges to purchase migrant laborers as well. Who in Baghdad could make these sorts of arrangements without raising suspicion? There is but one man, Mas'ud Al Yaqub. He runs Baghdad's soap mills. Finds paying work for foreign settlers, most of them Persian. 
So he forces these laborers into working his dig sites. All under the guise of providing them with a livelihood. Mercy! He tracked down one of Al-Ghul's dig sites, posed as a prisoner. What happened? The search turned up nothing. But that did not stop the guards from trying to silence us. I cracked one skull and fled. I doubt the others were as lucky. A foolish thing to do with nothing to show for it. Not nothing. Harun will be at the Karawansarai. I overheard the guards talking. Of course. Merchants from all over stop there to rest. If Mas'ud is buying migrant workers, it is likely the Karwan Sarai is where he conducts his affairs. What does he look like? He is a large man. Favors adornments like jewels and silks from the east. Then he will be hard to miss. It is time, Basim. What is your plan? That will be for Basim to decide. Basim? Alone? No. Let me gather some men. And allow for foolish spectacle. Your day to display your prowess will come. But this day belongs to Basim. Consider it part of our agreement. Basim? I am ready. Then walk with me. Come, Basim. Their member is within our reach, Basim. <laughs> like those before and those yet to come, Al-Ghul's death will be just. This is a man who preys off the desperate and the disenfranchised. And such atrocities will only continue, for Al-Ghul is but a cog in a larger wheel, one that spins destructively. So long as it does, we hidden ones will make it our mission to slow it to a stop. Today, you will lend your hand your blade to that very mission. And while Al-Ghul is your first target, he will not be your last. I have great belief in that, and in you. Through all my stoicism, my harsh lessons, know that you have impressed me, Basim. The Order's presence in Baghdad and beyond rests on shifting sands so long as you remain at the tip of our spear. And that is where I intend to remain. Beholden to your guidance, Master. So, our first official assassination. Busy as a beehive. Come, set your sights on the trunk. Merchants, livestock, caravans from all walks. And I thought Anbar's markets were disorderly. Where there is disorder, there is chaos. And chaos can bring opportunity. See what avenues present themselves. Be reactive, but patient. And trust your instincts. That is Mas'ud, on the balcony, just as Ali described. I see him. Go now, wet it with the blood of the slain. I will find you when it is over. You think your cruelty is well hidden, Al-Ghul. For you chose those with little voice, whose cries you knew would go unheard. 
They dug at your bidding, died at your hand, and were cast away like so much refuse. All to scour the desert for some artifact. Even now you haggle for flesh, safe in the Karwan Sarai. You prefer your victims chained and starved. It is time you faced a man unbound. Stage is yours. Survey the area, Enkidu. <laughs> the fire has caused Rockus an alarm. I will be watching. What delays your departure, friend? Someone by the name of Mas'ud saw fit to inspect my wares. And so, here I wait. Who does he think he is? What is it you are carrying? I ask only so that I may collect it for you. Would you do that? I would take great joy in seeing that man in a fit of anger. It is a crate of silks and spices. Ready your camel. I will see what I can do. If I can get that merchant to leave, his abrupt departure may lure Al Ghul out. Great with spices and silks. There cannot be too many of those around. Yeah. Yes.
messed it up. Hmm. Pungent. This must be the caravan merchant's crate. Pretty close, maybe. Is, that, is this your crate? Ah, it is indeed. The guards returned it to you. In a manner of speaking. Very good, very good. I must repay you. You seem like a man who enjoys a good meal. Care for some spice? Not today, no. But I will ask that you loudly proclaim your departure. Make sure Mas'ud notices. <laughs> we share the same mind. My thanks to you, ya sadiqi. What?
A strange thing to happen upon. Perhaps I can use this to my advantage. Word will surely get to well is to make you Come happy. out and spectate. Name Coward. your price. There he I is. won't disappoint. Now is my chance. Speak by my finest agent. I defy anyone to find better in all the empire. Nice. Turn your hate inward, Masoud. It is your wickedness that has led you here. Wickedness? To whom? The unenlightened? The feeble who have cast their lot? It is our divine will to rule over them. Our duty to exact their contribution. Contribution? To what? To what could be. The very knowledge of which lies buried beneath these sands. Some things are meant to stay that way. No, 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 no. These are gifts destined to be recovered. They speak to us, as you well know. Me? Oh, yes. The hidden one you may be, but not just. Clear your mind. Al Ghul's relentless pursuit at the expense of human lives has come to an end. It is a day of victory, not only for those spared of his cruelty, but for the hidden ones. The Order's grand plot in Baghdad may still be a mystery, but we can at least be certain Al Ghul's role in it has been vanquished. I believe what he sought to uncover were more strange objects, like the one I took from the Winter Palace. What does the Order want with these relics of the past? And why guard them with so much effort? You are beginning to ask the right questions, Basim. We shall find the answers together. Lately, all I have are questions. What do you mean? Nothing. Forget I said anything. How am I to guide you if you will not speak openly? 
I have... I have... struggled with nightmares. In these dreams, a jinni torments me until I wake up panicked and soaked with sweat. In Alamut, I had nearly forgotten about it. But when I killed Alhul, I felt its presence again. And I am left asking why? Why here? Why now? Why me? Piling questions and no answers. I meant to tell you, but... You were afraid I would think you weak of mind. We are only as weak as we allow ourselves to be. To shed a weakness, you must do what is necessary to mend that which causes you pain. Will you permit me a brief respite? I wish to seek out an old friend. Niha? I remember. She is important to you, isn't she? She is. But last we spoke, I led her to believe otherwise. This causes you pain. Then go and heal this wound without delay. Find me at the Harbia Bureau when it is set out. If that was indeed Nihal, I have not a clue where she went. Back home in Anbar, maybe. Um, I'll uh, see you guys in the next episode. Bye.